Oh my God, people. that's just crazy. That's how people go everywhere. <laughs> we found papers in our driveway. The Jones family says it is a true blessing they were able to escape minutes before this violent tornado engulfed their grain and lumber business. We see what happened and I know it happened, but to see it happening is a very different feeling. Security cameras set up around the property rode out the storm just long enough to give a rare glimpse inside the devastation. The sight is shocking. My dad and I drove into town this morning and I just started crying. I was like, does this look worse than yesterday? And he's like, no, you just didn't see it yesterday. We know we have a job to do to get it cleaned up and, and so that's what everybody's focused on. And The force was so strong it lifted the shop off the foundation and gently moved it next door. Some things still perfectly in place while others traveled miles. My husband's father passed away in 2006 and we had taken over the company when all that happened. Um, and we found a check that his dad had, a canceled check he had signed in our driveway at home. It's the small sentiments that keep Reading residents moving forward. The Jones family knows their life has changed forever, but they can't think of any other town they'd rather be. Just when you think that you're beat down and can't get back up and somebody will pull you back up or grab your shoulder or elbow and pick you back up and kind of keep you going again. It's just kind of an amazing feeling to be helped like that when you, you know that you can't do something or overcome something like this by yourself. In Reading, Lauren Seabrook, KTKA 49 ABC News.